Welcome to another video everyone. In this week's episode I'm going to be continuing on work with the cab as well as installing some other things onto my chassis like some mud flaps and some aerials. So without further ado let's get straight into it. So now I'm going to be painting the bull bar that I made. I'm just using a chassis black so it matches the rest of the underbody. Okay, so I just finished bolting the bull bar on to the chassis. So it's solid on there now. And now I'm going to give it another coat of paint. I'm missing a couple of the screws, like I mean the bolts for there and the one over there as well. I only had six of the bigger ones, but I've also got two little screws down in the bottom there as well. Two little bolts, not screws. Anyway, I reckon it's coming up pretty good. Then I'm going to build a custom winch plate to sit in the middle there, as well as probably put some spotlights in there and on the other side over there, as well as my aerials are going to go in here. So. I think it's going to look pretty good. So I just finished giving the bull bar a second coat of paint, as well as I installed the two aerials. So now I'm going to try and get the mud flaps on in the back. Just installing the mud flaps now. So they're sitting under the back here. There's a fair bit of ground clearance still. I reckon they look really good sitting there. So now I'm going to probably put some stickers and stuff on the tow bar and that later on, but. I think before I do that, I'm going to clear a space for my cab when it comes back from the sandblaster in the other garage, so that can go on as soon as that comes back, I'll paint it, um, yeah, I'll prime it and then I'll paint it with the Raptor liner and that'll go on. And then I'm going to paint all the other parts and that, and then, yeah, but I think before I put the cab on, I'm going to put the engine and gearbox in, so I, once the cab goes on, I can start wiring everything up. So I've done a fair bit since that last clip. I've installed some stickers onto the bull bar, as well as the tow bar. I'll show you them in a minute. But I also installed the radiator surround, as well as the brace there. I was going to install the other one, but I'm going to put the motor in from that side. Up the back, and put the spare wheel up in there. And just lift it up, it's pretty simple. And then I'm not sure how well you can see that, but I put some stickers on the back here. So I'm pretty happy with that. It's starting to really come together. So now I've got my cab back from the sandblaster. It came up pretty nice. There's a fair few more rust holes than I expected, but it's not too bad. It's going to take a little bit of work. There's a fair bit of rust in the floor pans down in the corner, as you can see over there. And there's a few bits of rust on the outside, but otherwise it's in pretty good condition. It's still really solid, but I've already cut out a bit of the rust that I cut out earlier. And now I'm going to be welding in some new panels and stuff later on, but first I'm going to prime it. So I'm just using a dark grey edge primer just to seal it off so it doesn't flash rust. As well as using it for a nice undercoat before I paint it. that's all for this episode. In the next episode I'm going to be continuing on fixing the rust as well as sanding and priming a lot of the other body panels. I hope you enjoy it. Make sure to look out for more videos coming soon. I'll see you in the next one.